Happy Saturday, everyone. How's everyone doing? Oh my God, Keith. Thanks, Rashida. Hey, Steve. Good morning. Y'all, happy Saturday. I'm so excited. This is my favorite, like most beautiful time of the year. I'm coming on just for that. I'm coming on just to say that. To say, how's everyone? I love you guys. Spreading the love. Yes, I have new music coming out this year. But we're not talking about that. We're literally talking about how this week after uh, Super Bowl, we have the most amazing, positive... Like, I don't know how to explain it without having to... I'm talking about... Look, we're talking about faith and religion. Lent starts February 14th, and on the same day of, you know, the day of love, of kindness, um, Valentine's Day. And let me tell you something, Lent is a time of just beauty, a reset. Everyone's been talking like, oh my God, do you see the shift? Do you feel a shift? It's not a shift, it's God. It's that beauty, it's that positivity. And let me tell you, growing up, my grandma will always be like, Oh, you guys, this is the time that you, for your intentions, this is the time, you know, for you. Sorry, they're, they're calling me. This is the time for you guys to set your intentions and your prayers because by the time it gets to Easter, everything comes like true. Like, I don't know how to explain it. So you guys. Someone on here is calling me. Stop calling me. <laughs> Please. I'm trying to talk to you guys. I never, I never come on this. So listen, make sure you guys try to, you know, go on. If you're not celebrating. Go on some kind of like positive, you know, path during this time of the year. You know, give yourself. to the higher power, which is the higher power, God. I, I, I'm sorry, as a, as a Christian, I'm, I'm not going to sit here and be like the, the universe. I'm not about that life. No. Give yourself to God. Give yourself to the positivity in the air that is being literally, literally given to you in a platter. That is what this time literally signifies for the world. And I woke up this morning and I was like, oh my God, I got to tell people. I don't know why it just came upon me. No, guys, I didn't have coffee. I don't do drugs. I don't, I don't do any of that. But I just wanted to say much love, much kisses to all you guys. You know, look, I know we all come from different, you know, religions in the world. And we, we, we um, honor God in different ways. But listen, join it. Join this situation, whatever it is. There's also the Halo app. No, I'm not. Uh, they're not paying me. The Hollow app is amazing for Lent. There's prayers and people talk about their experiences, real people in real life, like real things, you know. And even if you're not in the faith or any of that, it'll be just a good thing to get into and see what people go through and how faith and positivity and just believing that life is going to give you what it's supposed to give because that's how God intended it for you. That is how you get through in life. I don't want you to believe, listen, this Saturday morning, I'm here to tell you there's no way you're going to tell me that you guys were born just to be born. Nobody is just born to be born. Everyone has a purpose. Everyone, life is not just to be lived. Life is to be enjoyed, okay? Yes, there's sacrifices. Suffering brings about repentance. We go through things, but that's life. So I just want to say that I love you guys long time. Follow me on TikTok. We do it a, a lot of lives. You guys are missing out. I am not doing the lives here too much because it's just I haven't figured it out yet. Um, I just want to say love you guys. And thank you for all the support. Yes, I have new music coming. You already know. <laughs> but most than everything, I just want you guys to just be positive. That's all I'm, I'm getting on here. Be positive during this time of the year. 
be kind, give almsgiving, give charity. Even if you have a dollar, give someone 50 cents and it will be returned right to you, right back to you. Set the, set the intentions for, you, for yourself and your family and your life and, and, and your future. And believe that there is, that God is with you. Believe that you are made of something. I'm just saying this because on my TikTok, I encounter a lot of um, people that are double-minded about their lives, about their, you know, who they are and what they can give. Listen, it's not only celebrities and people with platforms that are made to do things. No. And we're not even made to do things probably how you guys are doing it. Remember, before you become someone in, 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 the, in, the, in the limelight, in the spotlight, we have to get an okay from all the people behind the curtains, the people really doing the work, you know? So pat yourself in the back, get up, and literally, literally believe in yourself. That's all I want to say. And I love you guys. Center for yes. Make a TikTok account and follow me. It's um, Cataluna Music. We're going to talk about it tonight. Literally, we be on for like an hour. Like, literally. Like, we have a little community. <laughs> Talking about life, everything that's, that's there under the sun. Um, but I love you guys so much. And... Anyone that, you know, look at me, I'm so calm. Anyone that's saying negative things, just give them to God or just let it be. Because you got to live, hi, it's Saranda. You got to live in your truth. Listen, you got to live in your truth. And you got to live in, but in your good truth. Don't make people do bad. Don't get in people's business either. It's Valentine's Day too. Stop telling people to break up. <laughs> Mind your business because... You're getting in the way of God's purpose. Let me tell you, that's another, listen, y'all need to come on my TikTok because we, we need to talk about these things. You can get it, you can get, if you get in between God's purpose, there's big karma. <laughs> but anyway, overall, live your truth, be in your life, mind your business, and concentrate on you. I don't care if you have kids that are grown, mind your business, let them be. I don't care, you know, give an advice to a friend, but then step back, you know, live your truth. This is a positive advice, but it's also a strong one because I think that's the problem in life. We're too intertwined with others that we don't look at our own lives and then time passes you by and you're like, oh my God, I didn't live my truth. Okay. Listen, you guys follow me for a reason. <laughs> a lot of you guys don't know me off stage, but if you do, I love hard and I just love to love life and I love to enforce people to love life and give it your all, you know, but mind your business, mind your business and pray for your life. And then you're going to see that that job is going to call you back. That, that business that you're starting up from, from home is going to take off. You're going to find God. You're going to find faith. Your children are going to get, you know, saved. Your little children. They're going to get saved. Your relationship. Your husband is going to come home to you and actually see you. And, and oh my God, I love this woman. Mind your business. I think that's, I think that's what we're going to say. During this time, we're going to search for God. We're going to search for ourselves. And find ourselves, live our truths, mind our business, and live life. So that then, once we mind our business, then we're able to give whenever we are needed. Not our whole entire life and self, but a little bit. And you guys, I am extremely kind. And if I'm saying this, because I'm extremely nice to people. But if I'm saying this, it's coming from a real place. So today, I'm, I know I'm going to go now. I love you guys. Go follow me on TikTok. But today, tell yourself, I got to mind my business. I got I to gotta pray for myself, for my house. If you're grown, you got to pray for yourself in your romantic relationship or your friendships. But mind your business. Pray for yourself. Have your own time. And you'll see that life, Medharba, life is going to get so much better for you. There's so much in life. Because you guys, I'm saying it this way, but it's because I just see people just not living at their best. Because they're not minding their business. Read a Bible. Read the Quran. Go dancing. Go to Zumba. And by the way, I just made a friend who I love, and she's like 65. She's amazing. She tells me, whenever people ask you how you're doing, say, you're doing spectacular. So tell people you're doing spectacular. 
Make sure you're doing spectacular. Good morning, Joe Steffi. We're telling people to search for God. It's the most beautiful time of the year. Lent, you know, um, is coming. And then after Easter, um, but right before that, it's Valentine's Day, the same day of Lent, the day of not only romantic relationships, but love. Don't tell people to break up. Mind your business. Stay within your own realm. Love your partner. Forgive. You know, oh my God, so many things. Love your friends. Love your family. You know, but all over, all over, all over. Mind your business and pray for yourself because you need it. I am letting you guys know we need it. There's a lot of warfare going around. There's a lot of warfare going around personally for people. And I am only speaking the truth because I be on TikTok like two hours talking to like 10,000 people about this. We're not talking about my music. It's going to drop. It's going to drop and y'all going to see it. <laughs> but I just wanted to see how you guys are doing here. Yep. And drink your water. Like Joe Steffi. By the way, check out her page. She looks amazing always. But seriously, you guys, like, stop messing people's, stop trying to get involved messing people's lives up. Because at the end, it's going to come back to you. Mind your business. Mind your business. Pray for yourself. People never tell you that, right? To pray for yourself. Pray for yourself. You could do it. Pray for yourself. Pray for yourself and then pray for others. I always tell people, if you're in a wrong place, don't pray for me. Because your prayer is not going to come from a real place. It's going to come from that place that you're hurt. It's not going to be, it's not going to, you know what I'm saying? So I want you guys to tell people in a nice way, love yourselves, pray for yourselves, mind your business. It's the most beautiful time of the year. It's, it's a godly time. It's a spiritual time. It is about God. I am, I'm not going to sit here and be like, it's the universe. Like, you guys want to come at me? Come at me. I don't believe in that new age stuff. God is God. God be God. And whether you like it or not, it's God. Okay? Stop stop sinning. If you don't believe in God, sit, sit down and be like, God, show me who you are right now. I've been telling people that. I saved about 10 people already. I didn't even know I had that. I'm like, God, wait, I'm supposed to be a singer. He's like, no, my darling. But you are anointed. That is why you sing. That's another conversation for TikTok anointed to bring people the news and i'm sure a lot of you guys are too thank you jeremy <laughs> but i am saying this with love i'm talking to you guys i'm that friend that's waking you up and be like yo get your ass up go to the gym write your goals set them let's do it you know what i mean let's do it i can't slow down boomers you gotta speed up and be on my you know what i mean Oh, I like that. I can't. Sl yeah, 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 yeah. The first people slow down. That I get you now. But literally, mind your business and take care of your life because you're letting it pass you by. If you have a friend that's going through marital problems, well, I'm talking about this because it's, it's Valentine's. Mind your business. Don't tell her to leave that man because let me tell you, you're sinning. You know why? Because you don't know. You don't know if that's God's plan for them to be together. And you're being the wrong influence. If you have kids and they're grown, mind your freaking business. Go worry about your man. Them kids going to do what they want at the end. Mind your business. Because you're not living from your full, you're not living from your full atonement. You know what I mean? If you're a naggy girlfriend, mind your business. Leave your, and the same thing for man. Curly Rose, you feel me? <laughs> if you're somewhere and you're, you're up to get something, stop competing with people. Mind your business. Oh, that so-and-so did this first. Okay, that's their story. Mind your business. If that were the case, I would be dying right now. God has a specific appointed time for your blessings. Yes, Matian. For your blessings, okay? But if you're too worried about someone else's blessings... Even if they're your kids, and I'm only singing kids because I'm assuming that is the, the most, that's the thing that people really can turn away from. But you're doing it wrong. Mind your business and live well. And I'm just going to pray, you know, every day, pray every day. And remember, this is a time of prayer, fasting, do, um, giving, um, giving almsgiving, um, you know. Yup, Curly Rose, you said you randomly came on this and you wasn't supposed to be here, but you needed to hear this. Curly Rose, amen, girl. Girl, Curly Rose, do a TikTok so we could talk about it tonight. Like, we'll really talk about it. Like, we talk about it the whole time. And I'm learning this. I'm also learning this from people on TikTok because there's a lot of people that are also older than me and I'm learning. I have a friend now that she's 64. She tells me everything about life. 
<laughs> you guys, I'm, I'm, a, I'm funny. No, but it's true. Like, go about life. You know, it comes from me too. Like, I'm always involved in people. I always was involved in people's lives. Oh my God, they need to hear this. They need to hear this opinion. Because I want... That didn't serve me well. Like, I needed to mind my business. So that literally I can worry about me. You can be in 10 places at the same time. Everything has an expiration date. Even in the animals. You don't see how the lioness lets her cubs go after a time. Mind your business. Worry about your marriage. It's in the floor. <laughs> All that I'm worried that... I'm worried because I don't know if my friend or her man... Mind your business. That's their thing. You give them advice. Oh, that I'm worried that I don't know if my sister is not getting it right. Look, if you're not leading people to God or you're not leading people, you could give an advice and step away and pray for them, right? But if you're not leading people, I don't know, to a healthy life routine quickly, then you're doing it wrong because you're, you're hurting yourself, okay? I know you feel it. You're going to be literally like... You have no energy. You know what I mean? That's not life. And I'm sorry, being Latin or a woman of color, all of us, all, 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 all the countries that have color, <laughs> we don't mind our business. <laughs> Joe Steffi, really? Okay. Girl, you see, it's hitting everyone because it's the truth. I was supposed to literally come on and say this. I don't care. Come for me. I'm not talking about anyone specific in my life because I will tell you in your face. That's who I am. I'm that girl that you love or you don't because I say, I say the truth. But you need to internalize, come to yourself, and just live your best life. Whenever I gave someone advice or corrected someone, I turned out a bad person from that. Yes, and then it's Sarah 724. And then that's bad juju on you because then this person that you tried to help out now is wishing you bad. Like, why? We don't need that. Confirmation, confirmation, drink water and mind your business and give yourself into this season. If you want to have something literally come forward in your life, whether you believe or not, I'm, I'm asking you to please believe. Ten girls already are reading their Bible from us talking. You don't believe in God? I'm going to tell you he's real. I'm not going to sit here and be like, oh, I respect. As a Christian, I can't say that. As a Catholic Christian, I can't say that. He is real. But what I will say, because of the blessing, listen, the blessings that I'm receiving, just getting closer to God. Y'all, go read that Bible. Be like, God, I don't believe in you, and I'm sorry, but look, I'm just trying this. Can I open the Bible and see what you, what you want to instruct me? When you open it, God will talk to you, and you'll see things happen for you. I'm about to have people do testimonies. <laughs> I became Pastor Cat. <laughs> I'm being funny. I'm being funny. I'm not a pastor at all. I'm just a humble girl that believes in God. And I come from a lot of experience. I've traveled the world. I've met a lot of people in a lot of places, high, low places. So I'm just sharing with you guys. Mind your business. Make sure that you're living your life to the best, best, best level that you, you can live it to. I believe in God, but praying and meditation. Okay, yes, Curly Rose, do it. Lent is going to start this Wednesday, February 14, on the same day of the Day of Love, Valentine. Do you don't see it? Just it's such a beautiful time to be alive. Start your prayers, fast, you know, your intentions. If you've never prayed before, try it. Just listen, try it. You try drugs, right? You try liquor. Y'all don't come for me. You lay up with people you don't know, you just met, right? I'm not judging. I'm just being real. I'm that I'm that girl that I'm Dominican, so you know I'm coming. I'm 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 gonna say it. No more, no more filter cat from, from now and forever. So if you could do that, you could give God a chance. You understand? Give it once. Just give it once. Give him a chance. Be like, God, you know, can you please? Exactly. Why not try praying? Just try praying once. Try it once. And you'll see because I just want you guys to receive such a beautiful time. Because after Lent for 40 days, I'm going to give up a few things. I'm going to come on TikTok and I'm going to tell you guys what I'm giving up um, tonight. Yes. Oh, wait, hold up. I do not like your name. Change your name, baby boy. If you're not a, a satan, a whatever it is, change that name. That's not good for you. But anyways, um, yes, fornication. All these things are in. We're all doing it. I'm not, I'm not sitting here like an angel. 
People want to try everything but God and pray it, knowing it'll save you. Yes, because you guys, by the time of Easter, you're praying through Lent or you're, you're fasting. Or let's say you're just giving something up. Start, start little. Let's say you give up coffee for 40 days. I mean, that's hard. But, but you know, God, the Lord will see your effort. And when God is love, amen. Yeah, above all things, he's love. Is a time of love. And when Easter comes, yo, I have never not prayed for anything that doesn't come true. Or I just pray, you know, but me, I pray for people. I pray for the humbling of, of a lot of folks, for life itself. I wasn't meant to see this life today. Praise Jesus. Amen. Amen. Praise. Damn, I'm, I'm getting led to think that I, I've, been, I've been keeping you guys kind of like, I've been ignoring IG. You guys, we literally, we literally be on TikTok doing this. Top 10. That is beautiful. Can I ask you, what do you mean that I'm butterflies? I just want to know. You are butterflies. That is beautiful. That is beautiful. Thank you. You're giving me a confirmation to something. You see? It's not only me. I'm getting confirmations on this too. Guys, God is... You know what? Before I leave, hold up. Stay there because I'm supposed to leave. Ah, uh, Don't leave, you guys. Hold up. Let me try something with you guys. I do this on TikTok. I'm just going to try for, ooh, I'm going to try for two seconds. I do this on TikTok. And um, we kind of feel like the Holy Spirit. I, I don't know. Let me, let, me just, let me just be led. Hold up. It's a song. I mean, we'll pray like a, hold up. I'm praying. I'm, not my song, y'all. Not my song. Maybe I should tell you it's my song. So y'all stay. Don't leave. Hear this song. And I feel the Holy Spirit. Tell me what you guys feel. Just feel it. Just stay there. This is for the people that say that we're supposed to be on live. God is real. Amen, Curly. This was meant for you to be on. I wasn't going to do this, you guys. But I'm doing it. For, I feel like you guys, this song is called To Worship You, I Live by Israel. To worship you, I live, I live to worship you. I did, I blocked them, I blocked them. Let me see. I love this song. This is how I sit. One more. 
one more chorus and then I'm going, okay? <laughs> Blessings to all you guys, nothing but positive. <laughs> positive love your way. Yes, we need love and peace everywhere across the board in the world. <laughs> this is that week. So it's saying, to worship you, I live. And it goes like, to worship you, I live. Can you believe? <laughs> We're like praising together, guys. I live, I live to worship you. To worship you, I live. Guys, this is happening out of the out of the blue. I didn't know. <laughs> Anyways. That is so beautiful. Anyways, this song is called To Worship You. You, I did it from YouTube. You guys can look it up. It's beautiful. Put it on. But like I said, I came on to say I love you guys. Wishing you guys the best. Only happy, happy vibes. Continue. This week that's coming up is one of the most spiritual, just most beautiful weeks that start up, you know, until... Uh, sorry, until Easter. I'm thinking Spanish. Ah! <laughs> uh, el cuaresma antes de la Semana Santa. Estamos hablando de eso. Hay que entregarse. If you haven't done it before, do it now. I love you guys so, so, so much. God's blessings. And may you guys literally, may you guys literally receive everything that God has for you guys. And make sure that you guys spread the good word. Even if it's a good, even if it's a good advice. But for a little bit, remember what I said to you guys, mind your business, okay? Mind your business and mind your own, okay? Mind your own, concentrate on yourself, concentrate on prayers for yourself. If you have, you know, if you're grown, concentrate on you and your household. If you have grown kids, pray for them, but mind your business. Let things happen so you can concentrate on you, you know? If you have friends that are not listening to your advice, step back a little bit, pray for them from afar, but worry about you. There are too many people not living their lives to the fullest. Oh my God. Anyways, I love you guys. To all the real people on here, much love. Just to everyone, even the fake pages, but. <laughs> My lives are on TikTok. Make sure you follow me. It's uh, Kat DeLuna Music. And um, let me know. To worship you, I live. That's literally what you have to do in life. Live for yourself. And if you believe in God or not, put him first. Love you guys. Bye. God bless you. <laughs> Follow me on TikTok. <laughs> okay, bye.